Welcome to Flatland, a world of only two dimensions. Only forwards and backwards, left and right. In this world, there is no up and no down. I said to Ray, where's Dottie? He said, well, she's out in line. I said, well, uh, huh? What the bleep is that thing? In this world, the two-dimensional beings that live here have no concept of three-dimensional objects. These two-dimensional flatlanders have no understanding of cubes, spheres, tetrahedrons, or yours truly. From their 2D perspective, my 3D finger looks something like this. Hello, little circle. Uh -uh. Fear of the unknown. Or should I say, not yet known. It's a puzzle. If we see only what we know, how does anyone ever see anything new? The unknown. How do we ever get out of our box? Hello, little circle. <laughs> Don't be afraid. Who oh, said that? Where are you? This is always the tricky part to explain. I'm in another dimension, another space. I am above you. What word? The A word. Above? Ah! Oh, it's forbidden. <laughs> well, what do you think it means? I don't know. And I don't want to know. You can be severely punished if you use that word. <gasps> Are you a ghost? <laughs> I hope not. I just have a different perspective than you do. I can see things in a way you can't yet. Oh, yeah? Like what? Well, okay, you have a safe hidden in your pantry. <laughs> and inside it, you have 12 coins, a will, and a passport. How did you know that? What are you? Are you a god? <laughs> well, no more than you. You see, since I am above you... <laughs> in the third dimension, I can see inside things in your world. Third dimension? You are a crazy ghost. There's only two. Look. So, if I were to touch the inside of your stomach, how would I do that? Well, you'd have to cut through my skin. Otherwise, it's impossible. <laughs> Ready for more? More what? Dimensions. Oh. Directions. Uh, no. Yes, but, oh. But there aren't any. More? 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 What will happen to me? What will I become? You'd have to become it to know. Isn't it funny? That which we are most afraid of is what thrills us the most.